while riding your bike can be achieved in a variety of ways. The handlebar is one of the easiest components to look to for improvement in your comfort. I'm Mary Jo Monty from the Path Peddler Series, talking to Bruce Baldwin of Ernie's Bicycle Shop. Bruce, when we buy a bike, it comes with a handlebar, but most of us don't realize that we can customize that handlebar to make us more comfortable. Tell us how. People come into the bike shop all the time and they're interested in sitting a little more upright, maybe taking some of the weight uh, off of their hands. And there are a lot of different types of handlebars that you can put on your bike to put yourself into a variety of different positions. So just because you buy one type of bike doesn't mean you can't change the handlebar? No, handlebars can be changed. There are some specific kinds of details that you need to be aware of. Things like the handlebar clamp diameter can be different on different bikes. So it's maybe a good idea to go into your local bike shop with your bike and let them measure your stem and handlebar combination and see which one will fit and then get you into the position that you're looking to sit. Okay. Um, this particular bar has a, a slight rise and a little bit of a sweep back. And that's these are the kinds of features that you can change by, by going to different kinds of handlebars. The rise of a handlebar is the distance, could you hang on to that yeah, a little bit? Yeah, sure. From the stem center, where the stem would clamp to the handlebar up to here. So this is about an inch and a half, two inch rise bar. Mm -hmm. There are lots of other options out there, like this. If you want to be really upright, this one's got probably about a five inch bar rise. Mm -hmm and a little more swept back. Old style cruiser bars. These come up quite a bit and not only do they come up, but they come way back. Uh -huh. So you could have a, a nice wide stance. Well, and it gives you a lot of places to put your hands. It does, it gives you a lot of different options there. Okay. No matter what bar you want though, what I was talking about earlier, it has to match up to the stem. There are two different types of stems that come on bicycles. This particular model is a quill stem. It has a, a bar that goes down into the, the frame of the bike and the fork, and then the expansion wedge tightens to hold it in place. You can get these that are adjustable, so you can change the angle. So if you want to be really upright, you could put it like that and then put your handlebars okay. through here. Or if you want to be a little bit more forward, you can do that. And once you get the, uh, the angle that you want, you just tighten up this bolt underneath and it holds it in that position. So you can really play around with there the are, positioning of your handlebars just with this one item. With just one item, it gives you a lot of different options to, to raise or lower your hand position. Mm -hmm. If your bike is a newer bike, it might come with the uh, headset type stem. These uh, clamp onto the fork and are tightened this way, but these also come in a variety of models that are adjustable. Just change the angle, you loosen up the bolt here, and then this angle, well this one's fighting me, but it does go up and down. Mm -hmm. And again, you can put your, your handlebars through here, mm -hmm. and again, with changing that angle, you can get in a lot of different positions. Yeah. All right, well thank you so much, Bruce. That gives us an idea of how we can change it up to make ourselves more comfortable, so we wanna ride more often. If you found this video helpful, click the subscribe button. And look for me at pathpeddler.com and on a trail near you.